again? Are we starting? Yeah, we're okay. ready. <laughs> What's up, gamers? It's Dom here. So you guys remember the pre-built 2021 CyberPower PC we got here from a couple videos back? Link in the description. Check it all out. Fun stuff there. But today is a little bit different. We're going to be upgrading the CPU cooler in it because by default, it's really not that good. It's really not that good for default CPU coolers. Um, so we're going with the old Nocto here. Let me put it where you can kind of see it. Better. We got the Nocto NH and Chromax Black. Uh, we didn't go with the brown version there. We spent a little couple extra dollars to get the black version to match a little bit more. So let's just open her up here. Let's see, I don't have to cut anything before I do that. And uh, this is definitely my for a twist there, but you guys might have some different ones there. So as you can see, it's nicely packed in here. We've got the Chrome Axe, gonna tell us some stuff we got for it, uh, for Intel and AMD, but we're using the Intel for this CPU here. So we're using all the uh, kit there on the left for it. Uh, it comes with our own thermal paste there for it, as well as some uh, cables for noise adapters uh, if it's not controlled by your motherboard there. So let's move this back just a little bit. Then we'll just go to town here. So, as always, you guys are putting in some new CPU coolers. First off, make sure that bad boy is turned off. There we go. There's our there's our fan right there. And I'm trying to wiggle it out here. So I don't want to damage the case or anything. So there we go. Take it out there. So let's see. I'm gonna take it out of the case now. Like this. Pop it out. Boom. There we go. There's everything. But before we do that, we have to actually go in here and take out this CPU cooler first. So let's just go to town here on the right one. I don't have much room, but we're gonna make it work. Uh, I believe it actually does come with that its own. Screwdriver. I shall see. So there's some tutorial stuff there. Based on if you have Intel or AMD. Here we go. Look at that. Trusty Dusty. So I'm move all this stuff kind of over here. I like to play it safe. I don't know about you. Because I got bad luck. So we're gonna be using a little wrist strap here also today. So make sure everything's turned off like I said. And let's get these screws out of here oh uh, what's the saying lefty loosey righty tidy you told me that i told you that because they don't teach you that in school so. i already knew that before you told me but yeah but they didn't teach you that in school they did not teach me that in school they had to teach you that in homeschool i didn't know that in homeschool either yeah. well now you know that's internet school. advice tech advice so ma, 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 ma. Ooh, tempered glass Got to go wrong there. Well, I don't have any places to put it, so we're going to put it on top of the Fritos bag in the water over here. So, that nice crunch. ASMR. That nice crunch there from it. <laughs> All right, so let's see what we got here. So, if you want to be a little bit closer, I don't know if I can turn that in there. Maybe you can see a little bit better. On the inside, we got, so there's our stock fan here. This is, I don't know if I'm going to anything too crazy. Just pop this in here. Got our wrist strap going. I'm gonna do like a like a first person camera showing this off here. Like there, that's where your head would be. What? That's where your head would be if it's like first person. That's true. Ba -ba. There we go. So, boom, boom. All right. So, let's see. We got good old Cooler Master. We can see the CPU fans up here on the top right by our RAM. And we got a couple screws we're gonna have to get rid of, of course, for this. So let's go and let's unscrew them here first.
And then this one's blotch will probably fall off, probably pop off. Told you. There we go. So here's the problem here now. So we got that bad boy right there. It's tied onto it. And yeah, we need to get the cable tie here on the back. So I can try to cut it. I can try to snip it actually. I have my snippers right here from uh, my, what's it called? Um, let me just make sure I'm not cutting anything important. Pull that all the way around. Yeah. Well, better safe than sorry. We're going to flip this thing around real quick. Also, <laughs> I already see in my finger actually the uh, you're turning thermal, blue. Thermal compound paste. So. Are you excited to become a Smurf? No, not at all. So, not at all. Actually, let me pop you off. What? Just put it in random places. Okay, so this I believe, there it is, right there. I'm gonna go all the way. Where are you going? I'm trying to figure out where this is going. That's the one thing about pre-built is because you didn't build it yourself, you have to figure out what other people were trying to like accomplish and design, you know what I mean? So let's see. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like you can see right there, that's all of our like it. Thermal paste. No, don't <laughs> like it. Mom's if you like it, will you die? Well, you die. Really? Instantly. No, but it's not. What's good. it made of? It's thermal paste. Yeah, I don't know what that paste. is. What's it made of? <laughs> thermal paste made of paste. Daisy. So let's take back plate. Just pop that off. Yeah, so your back plate, you probably have to pop that off. Just a fair warning there on that one. Brutal. Yeah. You have to get a little aggressive with the back plate on that one. So let's see. We're going to take a new line. Line you up here. So just start aligning the new back plate up back here. So you can even see it. So there's that. Screw it in. No. So that's why these back plates right here is going to pop right in like that. Okay. And you can see it on your front up there where you're poking the holes through. It's going to meet us near the front, hopefully. Just got to be careful with these because they're not, they're not in yet, which is the problem. So as we put them in, oh my goodness. We'll do corner to corner. So let's do a corner to corner strat. And hold them in corner to corner. And as we do that, we're going to put in our spacer.
right here's the last little portion here we can see that the fan is going pretty fast there but we're gonna switch this over to my computer and we'll look at some specs there hey everybody what's up so we're here now on the test for the cpu um cooler it's the nocto one i don't know what i'm saying that you guys watched that video of course and we're going to be testing uh, it on Call of Duty Modern Warfare Survival. Now we have the test from before where the CPU was going absolutely bonkers, bonkers, insane at like 90 to 100 degrees Celsius. Um, now here, interestingly enough, the GPU is spiking up and it's almost like taking the, the, the spot of, you know, of how, uh, how hot the CPU was. Now the GPU was heating up, not dangerously hot, just going a bit above normal. So we'll move, we'll move around a little bit. We'll see. But like at this point right now, the CPU would be just absolutely insane. Uh, let's see, let's see if it's going to stick around this area here. I'm going to try to not get killed right off the bat. There we go. Oh yeah. Frames uh, stuck to 60. So there's that also. I don't have those stats set up right now. I'll tell you that it is running at 60 FPS there. And yeah, it looks like, so it was just freaking out at the, uh, the initial, in the, like, loading screen area. But now that we're in the game, running around a bit, it's not, it's not heating up really at all. It's nice. It's crazy that it's, it's going about, you know, 72 degrees Celsius there, whereas here it's only going about 69 degrees Celsius, which is nice. Uh, no pun intended. And CPU is looking phenomenal now, so I highly recommend Pick up a Noctua fan, not just for the pre-build, but just for every computer. I love Noctua, they just phenomenal. So, you guys know what to do. Like, comment, all that fun stuff. You guys want to talk about computer stuff, I have a Discord down below, too. Tell I me mean, all about your computer loves or hates or whatever's going on computer-wise. I, mean, I have a friend named Hig there. He'll definitely let me know. So, that being said, everyone, take care.